I guess uh, full court defensive transition. Uh, I got a couple things here before we get started. Uh, thanks for coming out. It's 9 a.m. on a Saturday. I was talking about teachers having their pro D and stuff. They were done yesterday, so you guys are here invested, trying to get your teams better uh, and be a better coach. So I really appreciate you coming out. Um, I got a couple things before I get started. Uh, club coaches, hands. High school coaches, or both. Sweet. I love you guys. You guys do, and ladies do a great, great job. Um, I'm 37. I am not trying to preach to you, but if you ever need anything, okay, email me, and I'd love to call, talk about basketball if you need any help at all, any advice, or you just want to shoot the poop about basketball. You're going to start the clock, man. I don't have an hour and six minutes worth of stuff. There we go. Okay. Um, I love to just talk about basketball if you need anything at all. Um, my advice to you is to find a mentor coach, I'll be it, if you need some help, like I said, uh, all our information is on our website, email me, give me a shout, I would love to help out, um, bump it into Allison and Mike here, I remember being a 23 year old little punk coaching a provincial team uh, back in BC, and I coached single A girls basketball, which some of you, uh, Coach Dealer there from Glenbro came back today, and he's joking around going, you know, I only coach single A boys basketball. You guys do a hell of a job. I did some of my best coaching with those single A girls basketball. So don't worry about the level. I'm no better coach than any of you guys or, or ladies out there. It's it's all basketball and it's and it's it, it's all the same. Uh, but I remember them showing up to provincial team practice at Southridge there back in White Rock and it meant a ton to me that they would take time out of their day to sit watch this punk coach the U15 provincial team. And I'll always remember that. But I always consider them when I get to see them, see how they're doing, um, it, it means a lot to me. But you develop these relationships not only with players, but with coaches as well. Um, so if you ever need anything, please email me, call me, um, and I'll get right back to you if you need any help at all. All right? Um, next thing. <clears throat> uh, I think I've grown up in a great time in basketball coaching. There's so much on social media, um, YouTube, on Twitter, on uh, Dr. Dish sends me something every week that, you know, you sign up for one thing. I'm, I'm just the same as you guys. I, I sign up for one thing and suddenly I get 12 emails. Here's the 12 best quick hitters against zone. And I click on that thing. I'm like, man, this is garbage. But, um, it's, but hey, I'm the exact same way as you guys and ladies. Not Dr. Dish. I wasn't hating on you guys. I was talking about the other thing I signed up for. Okay. Um, but I'm talking about any newsletter that you sign up for, they give you a million things. There's these quick six zone offenses, quick hitters player development stuff. My, my advice for you on that stuff is, yeah, look at it. Take it all. But at the same time, what are your values? What you, do you believe in? What, how do you want to teach? Because it's so easy to change from day to day going, hey, yeah, I'm going to run this. Oh, it works. The Warriors do it. Great. You don't have the Warriors team out there. Okay. Oh, the Spurs run this. Yeah, great. You don't have that. So what do you have? Who do you have? What do you believe in? Take it. What are your core values? Tinker with it. It keeps you motivated, uh, like we talked about learning and stuff, and you're always questioning yourself and, and trying to get a little bit better. But it's a great, great tool uh, to have, but I just be careful not to, to, to change a ton sometimes. All right? You guys, go on the baseline. That was me preaching, by the way. Okay, um, so my thing, uh, we're going to go defensive transition right now. You have to ask yourself, what is your defensive philosophy? What is your team made up of? Okay, now that's where it all starts. It starts on offense for me to develop our defensive transition philosophy. Okay, how many people do you send to the glass? Meaning, how many people do you have crash when a shot goes up? Okay, a lot of times if you are not as athletic, a little smaller, or getting back is a huge, huge thing for you. You only send two to the glass. I've seen teams send one to the glass. That means four people are, are get back guys and get back in transition. Okay. We always try to send three to the glass. Uh, I thought last year we were a lot better than this year uh, as our third wing would get to the, the glass for us. Uh, after seven games in the preseason, I am debating if we should only send two. Okay. Now, that probably means fewer offensive rebounds, but I don't think our third guy right now is going to help us chip in with one or one and a half offensive rebounds a game. So I'd rather send that person back. So that's a question you have to ask yourself. Is it worth it to send that third guy or is it better off just having him or her get back and, and then play five, uh, five and five in the half court? Okay. Um, 
next thing I have down here, uh, we try to preserve those core values for us. So when my shot goes up, okay, our two get back guys, we send three to the glass. Let's have uh, five whites on and two big guys and a point guard and a two. Perfect. Who wants to be the big? You know what? You're not going to be the big today because someone told you you're always the big. Okay, you get to be the point guard. Deal? Now you come play for me, you'll be the big, but today you get to be the point guard, all right? Okay, we just need one ball out here, all right? So here's my point guard, okay? And you're my two guard. Sweet, you don't have to get to the glass. Isn't this nice? Yeah, that's awesome, okay? So you three get to the glass. Now, like U of W, they'll have a short safety and a long safety, meaning a shot goes up, they'll have someone being short and someone getting really long. We don't do that. We just have two get back guys. So, uh, your name? Tyson, shoot the ball, Tyson. Now, there's no net to cash it if you hear a ball. Oh, good. Shot goes up, okay? Your name? You're going to be long. Yeah. Okay? So he will get as far back as he can. The second one we want somewhere in the jump ball, cir ball circle. Those are our two get back guys. These three will get to the glass. A uh, thing we try to teach and we don't do a very good job of this year is wherever the shot comes from, if we can get to the other side, the back side. Okay? Um, my coach at Brandon was Jerry Hemmings, and he swears he has his masters, but um, he talked about 70% of shots go long. Okay, 70 or 70, whatever he would say, okay, of shots would go long. So we were always teaching if a shot came from here, it wasn't good enough just to get to the glass here, it was try to swim, rip, whatever it is to get to the other side to give yourself a better chance of getting offensive rebound. Okay, can you swim? Can you get to the backside? So when a shot goes up, you three are getting to the glass. These two will get back and match up. Okay, pretty simple stuff. Yeah. Now, this year, like I said, maybe we don't send three to the glass. We only send two. Okay, like I said, our third guy might not be able to get glass for us. Next thing, once to get in there, and let's get five blacks on right now. We'll hop back on. And we coach... Okay, let's match up, guys. We have one too many. Oh, you can't even get a run in in dem demo time. Ooh, see you later, Dante. Okay, so shot goes up. Two get back. Three get to the glass. Go get back. Two big. Good. Perfect. Now, once we get a... Where are you two going? Black squad. Yeah, there you go. Not bad. Okay, we get a rebound. Okay, the first things that we need to try to make sure we take away hoop, okay? That's our biggest goal, is can we take away hoop as soon as we can? The next thing's the ball, okay? And then you gotta decide which way you wanna steer it. I've heard a lot of coaches talk about keeping it middle, okay? We try to force it to the weak hand. So, shot goes up and he gets the rebound. You guys crash, okay? We kinda matched up. Let's say, bring it up. Okay, let's say you stop. stop. You got with the ball, match up, match up, match up, match up. Perfect. Okay. Now, if we can somehow get established contact with the ball before half court, the hoop's taken, and we can steer it to a side, we've done a pretty good job. Even if it's odd numbers, even when we're still down five on four. Okay. The next thing we talk about, it'll look better when we're, we're getting up and down here, is the backside guy has to make sure he communicates he has two. Okay. He has two. Okay. And we'll show you in transition here. Um, the next thing we talk about is if I'm trailing the play, I make a play at the ball, I try to get glass, I swipe at it, I miss, I'm the get back guy. Uh, what's your name? In white. Ashley, hop off. Okay, I'm on white right now. Someone else pick up the ball. Good. Someone else match up. You got hoop, big fella? You got the hoop, right? Good. Okay, when I'm the trailer, I'm in transition. Okay, we teach our guys over and over again to run opposite elbow, okay? Hopefully our team isn't that bad, we were bad last night, okay? That we don't run to the ball side. I hope that my team is good enough, and your team's good enough, that they can get back and trans transition and take away and match up the strong side. Meaning on this side of the ball, I should not have to worry about that. I should be able to sprint. Let's get matched up over here. Come on, come up here a little bit. Okay, let's see we matched up here. And big fella right now should be yelling, I have two, okay, for us. He has two. My job is to run opposite elbow. Bring it up. I'm trailing it. I'm on defense. Keep sliding up, guys. I need to get to the opposite elbow 
and then try to take the second most dangerous guy. Big fella is going to have two for a second. If I can somehow get back into the play and buy time so we can get back to a five on five. Okay, so that's big for us. In transition, the hoop's taken away, the ball slowed down, the trailer or trailers run opposite, hopefully ball size taken care of. Any questions? When we get up and down, uh, feel free to ask questions. Okay, so how we will steer it to their weak hand. So we will try to keep the ball on that side of the court to start, and we run opposite down the right side. Okay, now, um, so our three goals in transition. One is no layup. Okay, it could be a hit ahead or a dribble layup, whatever it is. We try to take away any type of layup. Next thing for us is no open threes. Okay, uh, last night, they ran out of ink on the printer here, but I think U of M took 36 or so threes. We took just over 30, and I think those are the numbers you're going to see, and those are numbers we kind of want to take. Okay, the, the game's definitely changed, but especially transition or post-entry or offense rebound kickouts, there are going to be a ton of threes. Okay, we're trying to take away layups first. Okay, we're trying to take away any type of transition threes next. Okay, um, last but not least, we're trying to get back to an even number, meaning a four on four, five on five, okay, or somehow we get back and it's only a five on four for us. Right? Those are our three goals in transition. No layups, no catch threes, okay, get back to even numbers as soon as we can. Um, transition, for me, it's 80% effort, 20% communication. 80% okay? effort, 20% communication. Like I was telling you about Twitter, I just made that stuff up, but it sounds legit, doesn't it? It sounded like I did some study about it. I just made that up, okay? But for us, it is. It's 80% effort, okay? If you really, if getting back means that much to you, the first three steps in transition, you got to go, okay? And you can s tell which teams are going to have success on the defensive end and which aren't by the first three steps, the urgency to turn, sprint, and get back. That's it. It's 80% effort. And then after that, shoot, we should be able to match up and talk, okay? Okay? Um, We'll show you a couple things how we build up our uh, practice each week. We start transition from basically three on three in the half court, then we go two on two full court, three on three, four on four, five on five, okay? Biggest thing for me in practice is we want our guys to play at a high, high speed. The, what grade are you guys in, nine, 10? Sorry, nine, okay, nine. Only difference between these guys and the older CP group is that the older guys can play at a higher level, uh, sorry, a higher speed and be under control. And the only difference between those CP kids and some of my guys is that we can play at a higher speed but still be under control, okay? So our goal in practice all the time is try to push our guys to play faster, faster, get back quicker. Offense, we make a decision quicker, okay? So to get started, we'll have uh, whites on that side. We'll have blacks over here. Ball, please. Okay, Coach Norris got the white side. I've got this side. So we start with three on three in the half court transition. White, your ball, you'll go this way. Okay, you get three whites up. And we'll have uh, one black up here. You guys stay there. So we just, yeah, those balls look really safe down there. They won't want to hold them. Nah, we're okay here. You guys are good. Okay, so what's going to happen is instead of running and touching the middle like two on one and three on two, we give guys numbers to start. So I told these guys one. So as soon as that ball comes in, you don't have to touch the middle. You just run in and try to match up. Coach will give this team a number, two. So two guys go. Sometimes he'll say three. There'll be three guys matched up already. Okay. Any questions on that? Okay. Let's see what it looks like. Right now we start with one. This poor kid's left out here to dry. As soon as that ball goes past, okay, we sprint. Now let's say the ball goes over there. Who stop? Who's going to have the ball? You think? Perfect. So where did you guys run? Yes. Okay. It's just like we're trying to do in the full court, right? They run away from the ball. What I would not like to see is if he picks up the ball, the next guy runs that way too. You run opposite of the ball. Hopefully the ball side is taken care of. Let's see what this looks like. We'll play up to, can you count up to three? Seriously? All right. Okay. We'll play up to three. You're, you keep score. And uh, point guard, you keep score up to three. But... The rule we play is three, but every turnover is minus one. So some of these games take a long time. Ready? Here we go. Go run in. Run, go, go, go. Good. Good. Three, three, two, turnover, go. That's minus one. 
Uh oh. Go, 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 pitch it, pitch it. Yeah, as soon as the ball passes past this. One to minus one. You three, get off. As soon as it goes, get off, get off. Good, go, 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 go. Good job. Good, turnover. You're minus two. Get off. Uh, three. Three, you got a great time. No, it's all three of you are on there. Good. There you go. Good, good shot. Go, 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 go. Yeah, point guard, keep going. There you go. Ew. We'll count it. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Dude, you can't play four on three. You could. You could do it next time. How many of you guys have? Two? You have three already? What? We'll get one more possession. Go, 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 go. Ooh, two minutes for tripping. Dang it. Ooh. You all right? In 2K, that goes in usually. Good take. And game. Good job. Give these guys a hand. Let's go baseline down here. Okay, next. So after we get going for about two, three minutes, we play to a score, sometimes best out of three. Um, we get the full court into three on three and four on four. Okay, we'll go straight into four on four. We have four uh, whites across here, four blacks on the baseline. Okay, so we try to simulate what we do in transitions. Let's have four blacks up on the baseline. Across. Okay, so right now, We'll have, uh, you're in the middle here, okay, and your name, Ashton, okay, Ashton, your name, Ashton James, why can't I say that name, give me a nickname, Low, Ashton James, Low and Tyson, Ashton James, Low and Tyson, okay, uh, I saw Roy Williams in Vegas once, the most impressive thing I've ever seen at a coaching clinic. Roy Williams knew every single kid's name um, in the first 15 minutes. It was like, Lo, make sure you get back. I'm not going to try to do that. Okay, uh, Lo, you are going to stop the ball wherever it goes. So watch. He's my big guy. He's going to throw it off the glass. You guys don't take off. He's going to crash and get the rebound. You are going to pass it to anybody. Lo, wherever it goes, you got ball. He throws it here. Who's going to get that? Yeah, hold on. Hold on. Whoa, 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 whoa. That's awesome. That's quick. Okay. Low is going to take ball. You need to come touch the end here. Okay, so come. We have the guy who's furthest away take hoop. My man, Ashton. What are you going to do? Get back and sprint. And you go, I got hoop. I got hoop. Low will have the ball. Depending wh where it is, you need to find probably the guy who has two. And where are you going to run? If, let's say, the ball's down this sideline, where are you going to run? You run towards the ball, you run opposite. My man. Sweet. Ready? Here we go. Let's see what it looks like. Now, Lowe's job. We talk about being self-aware a little bit. Lowe has to know his own speed. Okay? We talk about defining reality for your student athletes. Some of your athletes aren't as good as they think they made themselves in 2K. Okay? They are not. Your job as club coaches, high school coaches, tell them. Be honest with them. Okay? There's about four guys on my team that I tell with every day. I say, I love you. I brought you here for a reason. Here's your role. Either you can do it or you can't. We got to move on. Okay? It's not being a jerk. It's not sometimes my language isn't the best. I love these guys. But you have to define the reality. Okay? For Lowe, his reality right now might be gapping an arm and a half. 
in two years from now, he be, might be picking up full court. He might be the best player in this group. I don't know. But his reality now is to slow down the ball. That's his only job right now. So when we go up, we'll throw it off glass. Low, wherever the ball goes, you got to stop it. Now, Lowe's job is going to suck if he gets blown by. His job is to contain and steer it one side. For us, if we can steer it by the, uh, sorry, by the volleyball line roughly to the left, we've done a pretty good job. If it's away from you, you get hoop. Okay, next person what running back will have two. We'll see what this looks like. Throw it somewhere. Go, 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 go. Yeah, low. Hands, low hands, good, good. Play it, play it, we're going back down, we're going back down. Oh, jeez. Go, keep playing. Four, three, two, go, take it out. Go, 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 match up, match up. Tempo, go, 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 go. Who's got ball, who's got? Good. One more, one more. Oh, boy, low. And time. Not bad. Okay, so how we rotate is those four blacks, come on here. The four, the four guys were just on offense, and let's get four whites up now. The three that were off and one extra guy. Yeah, you want to stay? Uh, no, you're off. The, the four that, were you just on? Sorry, my bad. Yeah. Okay, so watch, what's the name again? Dominic. Who? Dominic. Dominic has got the ball. He's going to throw it off the glass. My man, Alex, has got to get the ball. Okay, now, uh, Lo, you did a great job. Now, well, another thing we teach in transition, you watch low, he's been well coached. He gets in the slide right away. Okay, let's say I do have the ball. If I'm here, we just got to know your own speed. So if I can't slide with him here, that's perfectly fine. We just have him run beside. At some point, I got to pick a spot on the court where I think I can sprint ahead of and get square again. Okay, and then hopefully steer it to his left right now in transition. Okay, talking about knowing your own speed, uh, knowing who you are. All right, so Alex, you got ball, right? Okay, so we got, go, go. Go throw it up, get it, pitch it. Alex got ball, someone's got hoop, right? Here we go. Get up. Holy smokes, ah, go again. Go again, go again, go again, go again. Is this thing even on? Same group, stay on. So the rebounding clinic, Alex, is uh, next week. Ah, let's try this again, Alex. What school did he go to, Alex? Dominic, Dominic. Dom what school did he go to? No excuse. Alex, you got ball, right? Get up, Dominic. One time. Touch the baseline, genius. Good, go again, go again, go again. Good, do it again, Dominic. Throw it off the glass again, Dominic. And touch the touch the end in Winnipeg. Pick either one. Holy smokes. There you go. Good. Talk. Who's got hoop? Who's got hoop? Go. Oh yeah, I like it. Okay, now get back, stay match. Who's got it, you got it? Okay. Good, not bad, let's go, next group's up. Okay, so now we add on to it. These four are across, you can stay low. Okay, low, you'll throw it off glass. You gotta pick up ball wherever it goes. Okay, but now watch, who are the four black team up? Okay, so black team, when you guys shoot down there, you are going to get to the glass and try to rebound. You're going to get to the glass and rebound. As soon as any shot goes up, you guys got to sprint back as fast as you can. One of you is going to take the ball up, one's going to take the hoop. Got it? Okay, low, you're going to throw it off the glass. You got to jump, get it, touch one of the ends. Okay, you got the ball right. Try again. Should create a machine for rebounding. Here we go. Good. Who's got hoop? Good. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Well, that's 
stop. Get back, you two. There you go. Who's there? Get back, guys. Good, good. Go, go, go. I'll let it go. Go, go. Go run with them. Go, go low. Downhill. Go, go, go. Stay wide. Good. Okay. Get up. Not bad. Good job. We'll go one more time. Better. Now remember, remember, shot goes up. You two guys got to get back, right? Hey, those four who were just up, come on. You got to pick up the ball wherever it goes. You're going to get it off the glass. Shot goes up. Shot goes up. You're getting back down there, and you're going to get back. Low, you two crash. Off the glass and touch the end, all right? Here we go. Ooh. Good. N now we're matched. Go, 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 go. That's all. Perfect. Let's go one more. Way to pick up the ball quick. Rotate up. Rotate up. You guys are off. White, you're on defense. Those four. Low, throw it off the glass. You're going to pick up the ball. You're going to get back. You're going to get back when the shot goes up down there. Crash. Crash. Very low. Don't, don't overthrow it this time. Get up. Good. Touch, touch. Good. Ooh. Pitch it. Pitch it. Good. Pitch it. Hit it. Who are get back, guys? Two get back. Good job, bud. Ah. Get back. Go, 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 go. Pitch it. Good. Good shot. Okay, dead. Now we go to fives. Okay. Now, what we do a ton, let's get five uh, whites across the foul line. Oh, sorry, five blacks is fine. Five whites in the baseline. So what we do next is we either go five transition here or we start out of one of our offensive sets. Okay, so let's say you run uh, big to big cross screen or you run a spread pick and roll, whatever. Okay, we put our athletes in those positions. So we want to simulate that our five will be here, our three is here. We'll chuck the ball in, and we have to get back from those spots where our shots come from. So we run strong, and the shot comes from there. I know my four will be down here, my five will be there. We try to simulate where uh, our personnel will be so they know how to match up and where the outlet might go and how we have to match up quickly. All right? Um, yes? Oh, you, want, you want the ball. You always want the ball. Okay? Now, so how we're going to do this right now, uh, we'll just give you a number. Okay? So you'll be one, two three, you're my four, you're my five, okay? So the four and the five get stuck in the paint somehow, four, five, and the three is in the corner, and the shot went up from one, and two, here's the up top, okay? So shot goes up. These three guys have to get to the glass. So coach will chuck it out to one of these guys. Your only job, okay, you three, you need to get one foot inside the charge circle. Okay, to simulate that we went to the glass. Someone's got to go long as you can to be our long safety. Okay, second guy will try to pick up the ball. Okay, now in transition, offensively, we try to have ball handlers and one rim runner. With some of our lineups, we don't even have a rim runner. Okay, uh, our philosophy on the offense, man, if our big trails it, we have a big kid from St. Lucia, uh, about 6'11, he's lost some weight, about 265. Okay, if he trails it in transition, he automatically drags it. He automatically sets a ball screen transition. Okay, if he beats someone down the floor, for the love of God, that's really impressive. But if he does, we do look in and pound it into him. If he doesn't, then we kind of go a spread pick and roll and we play around him. Okay, and you know we ask a ton of him. And uh, but if he does trail it, we kind of know if we don't have a chance to play three on three, four on four, he'll step up, get underneath it, and kind of drag it uh, in transition. Okay, so we know which three guys are going. Okay, if you can handle the ball, handle it. If you feel like someone's better in front of you, better position, pitch it ahead and go. Okay, shot goes up, white team. You two guys, get back when you shoot down there. You three crash, got it? Yep. Holy smokes. There you go, talk it out, figure it out. There you go, it's pretty good. Okay, who's getting back? Who's getting back? Go, 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 pitch it. Go, go, pitch it. Pitch it. Pitch it. There you go, space. Good, not bad. Okay, 
Switch around. Okay. Now, the next thing we talk about, we slow, slow the ball, we try to keep it to the outside, preferably to their weak hand. Um, on the offensive end for us, we try to keep the middle of the floor as open as we can. Okay, we call it the alley. If our big does beat people down the floor, he can go straight down there. We don't really want our twos. Or I, I lose my mind all the time when some of our guards cut through there for no reason. Okay? We want to be as spaced as we can, especially the first you know, six to eight seconds uh, of the shot clock. We want the lane open, elbows open, so they can go downhill, have a chance to play. Okay? This, uh, so white team's up. Watch now. Which two guys are getting back? Perfect. You three need to get a foot inside the charge circle. Okay. Questions? Hey, oh, hold on. Sorry, coach. We're going to go here. We're going to go back. We're going to go twice now. Okay. So the get back guys on black, as soon as the shot goes up, sprint your butt back. Okay, here we go. Good. Who's, good. Who's got hoop? Good. Opposite. You front. Jeez. Get back. Who are get back guys? Go. Good. Stay wide. Good. Pitch it. Good cut. Get back. Get back. Go. Go. Take it out. Who's got ball? Who's got hoop? Are we matched? Are we matched? Are we matched? Who's got here? Are we matched? Low drop. Low drop. Go, 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 go. Really? That boy low. Good job, dead. Okay. Okay. Now, you know why I love kids? It's because the effort is awesome. It's ugly. I just heard, I heard someone in the stands kind of go, rebound. Like, you're really going to get mad at the kid at 9.15 on a Saturday. But he's like, rebound. I'm like, That's awesome. Okay, you guys are playing your butts off. Love it. You have no idea what's going on, but the effort is incredible. Okay, awesome. Whoever took the ball out without, whoever didn't even inbound the ball, I like it, man. Who cares, right? No one's yelling at you. Yeah, you did a hell of a job. Now, here's the next thing. So we get that, those groups back up. Okay. The hardest shot to get back in transition from is what? Anybody. You guys all have Twitter and no one reads this stuff? In transition, anybody? Okay, the most difficult shot for us and for most basketball teams, okay, is a corner three, especially by your point guard or your two get back guys. A corner three is, is, is trouble. Is, I guarantee you getting back is going to be 50 50. Okay, so we try to. Lucky our point guard doesn't move from there. Um, but we, we try to get a corner three, or when your guard gets buried and makes a play and thinks he gets bumped and he ends up lying down on the floor, fixing his four compression things instead of getting back. So um, when your point guard gets stuck or you get a corner three, those two things are the toughest things to, to get back in transition. So uh, who are two get back guys? Sweet, you're my man. Okay, ball's here. White, come on out. Okay, match up. Slide up. Come here. Come here. What's your name? No, Peter. Peter, come here. Ty, come here. Inbounder, guard him. I don't know your name, but you didn't inbound the ball. Okay, so Ty's a get back guy, and you're a get back guy. Okay, and you got three crashers, correct? Okay, now, you're a crasher, right? Okay, now, we try to get basketball IQ going. So if we have tie here and he's buried or he shoots a corner three that somehow there's some communication that one of you figures out that they're going to get back that we can't have my man down there all by himself getting back out of transition okay so when a shot goes up we need two get back guys but tie is stuck okay but we're gonna make it harder on you you're gonna be in the paint tie after you shoot it okay you're gonna go touch that proud member of can os it's a beautiful new logo isn't it okay shoot it Touch that and see if we can get back. Okay, white team, when the shot goes up down there, who are my two get back guys? Perfect. You three crash like crazy. If the ball goes in the hoop, what are we going to do? Take it out of bounds. All right, shoot it. Touch it. Go, 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 Ty. Stop, stop, stop. Go again. 
Go again, go again, go again. Come back, come back. Ty, shoot it again. Low, go get it, right? Ty shoots it and touches. White, box out. Black, know what's going on? Go touch, go touch. Good, go, 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 go. Match now, run opposite. Opposite, Ty, there you go. Good job. Beautiful, beautiful. Uh oh Go, go, go. Who's got ball? Who runs opposite? Run opposite. Come on, low, come on, low. Give me something. There you go. Go, keep playing. You're all right. We're going down and back again. Go, 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 go. Who's got hoop? Who's got hoop? Run opposite of it, match. There you go. Dang it. Get back. Two get back, guys. Low, get back, man. I'll let it. Pitch it. Pitch it. Pitch it. Oh boy. Good job. Give these guys a hand. That was pretty good. Okay, let's rotate. Locks up. We'll go corner three. Okay. Now, it was perfect down there because we did slow the ball. And where's Ty? Ty, you were awesome, man. You ran opposite. He ran opposite 45, and he talked, and he got matched. Okay, we didn't give up a layup, a kick out three. Okay, we got matched up in probably about six seconds. Okay, like I said, the effort is there, okay, and you can work with effort. All right, and they picked it up pretty quickly here. So we're matched up here. Now, we add in, sometimes we add in switches, okay, meaning... James, James will shoot it. Let's say we get the rebound. Alex, right? Alex gets it and we go. We're going down, down, down. You hear me say switch. Alex will put the ball down. Okay, and then White will pick it up and go that way. You guys will still get in defense. Does that make sense? We'll simulate a good turnover. The pace of play right now, you guys probably turn over just before I say switch. Okay? That was a joke. You like that, right? Just put the ball down. Yeah. Okay? Who are my two get back guys? My white team, shoot. Good, suck, you're getting back. One of you three gotta figure out to get back as well. Shoot it and touch the wall, right? Here we go. Go get it. Uh, go, stay here for a second. Go, 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 stay here. Wait, good. Good, switch, 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 switch. There you go, good, good, match, match. Talk to each other. Good, take it out. Ready? Good. Run opposite of it. Switch. There you go. There you go. Good spacing. Cool. Switch. Good. Who's got hoop? Talk to each other. Talk to each other. Good pass. Go, 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 go. Good pass. Shot. Dead. Perfect. It's a real good job, guys. I love the pace. Love the energy. Spacing sucks. Okay. But everything else is pretty good. Okay. Next thing. Um, let's get five black, five whites, all on the baseline. Oh, sorry. No, my fault. Six of you on the baseline. One black, one white over here. One black, one white over here. One black, one white in the middle. One black, one white there. One black, one white there. Okay, so a white match up there. Match up. We need one dude here. Doesn't matter. We're good. Ball coach. Okay, so stand beside each other. Get right to the baseline, guys. So we got to pay attention. I'm going to throw the ball. John. Let's say John gets it. What? Dion. Close enough, right? No, not even close. Okay. Black's on offense. So if that person, you guys will fight for the ball. So I might do this. Jump, fight for the ball. Whoever doesn't get it, okay, needs to go touch that wall. Does that make sense? Okay. You two guys, if it goes to one of you guys, okay, you need to go just touch the elbow. Make sense? Okay, and then everyone's gonna bust their butt back. So if Black gets it, you're on offense, you touch. If you five and four, you'll come back as well. Yes, no, if you don't know, just tell me. All right, perfect, yes. No, that way. That's a great question. You would have embarrassed everybody if you turned around and scored right there. I like it though. Ready, here you go. Oh, get it, get it, get it, get it, go, go, touch the wall. 
Go, go, go. Oh, you're screwed now. Get up. Oh, might as well stay down here, man. Go. And let's go again. Not bad. Good job. That's when you fake it and give it this one and then stay for the layup. I call it a Lynch Blair. Where's Lynch Blair? He does that all the time. He falls down and then he gets a layup. What? Huh? No, no. Whoever gets the ball, you're going that way. Okay? And the other team comes back. Questions? Fight for that. Well, yeah. Hold on a sec, Coach. Yeah. Yes. Elbow. Oh, whoever doesn't get the ball is on defense. Make sense? Oh, I like it. Oh, you got screwed. You might as well stay down here, bud. Who's getting back? Look, 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 look. Get over. Good job. Good. Swing, swing. Ooh. Good take. Go, get back. Go, 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 go. Who's got ball? Steer it. Whoa. Good, go, 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 go. Ooh. And dead, 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 not bad. Okay, try on the baseline. We got about 11 minutes left. Okay, uh, let's have blacks down there, whites down here. Okay, so we kind of work on transition. Um, like I said, I don't know the age of some you coach, but like I said, the pace is great. Yeah, not much is getting done sometimes, but you need them to play at a higher speed. They're not comfortable. They make decisions on the go. Uh, my favorite drill, uh, coach ball. Okay. I would say probably twice a week, three times a week, we go two on two, sometimes three on three transition. Uh, give me two blacks up. You three in that corner. You three in that corner. Get two blacks on defense. Coach, we'll go two on two transition. Okay. Let's get guys in that corner. Two guys on defense. Good. Okay. So you go offense to defense, and then you're off. So watch. These two guys come down. Let's meet them there. Okay. So chuck it. Just shoot it. Okay. Go get glass. Holy smokes. Get glass. Sweet. Outlet it. Okay. You guys get back, and they're going as fast as they can. Okay. Now, hold on a sec. The only rule is... When the shot goes up, you guys can do whatever you want. You can crash, you can, yes, sir. Yeah, 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 you're playing live, okay? But once you get a rebound, white team, you get an outlet, you want to go, we have to catch it below the three-point line, okay? We want to get out and go on offense, but on the defense end, can we get communicated, can we match up quickly? Questions? We're going to play for exactly 90 seconds. Ready, blocks, you're going to come down. After you outlet it, who's on defense? Outlet there, go. You guys be on defense after, right? Here we go. Tempo, tempo. Keep your spacing. Good. Good turnover. Go, 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 go. Pitch it. Oh, yeah, Alex. Oh, get back, get back. Pitch it. Whoa. Opposite. Stunt at it. Stunt at it. Good. 40 seconds. Good. Keep your... Good, keep your space, keep your space. Ooh. Oh. Hit it. Oh, you get it. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh. Go, go, go. And time. Good. Okay. Now watch time, time, time. Perfect. Okay. Let's get three lines. One line in the middle. One line there. Okay. Now, you know what I love about that is they're, what, 15, 14 years old. They were playing at speed. You can figure out pretty soon, pretty quickly, who can make plays at that speed and who can't. 
Okay? And there's no, there's nothing fake about it. There's no cones out here. There's no, who has those orange guys that stick up? Does anyone have those? Put your hands up. Do not lie to me. Are they a sponsor? Are they here? No? Sorry. Okay. But it's, it's nothing fake. You don't have gardening gloves on. You don't, you're playing basketball at high speed with other real people. Okay? And you can tell me in less than 100 seconds who can play at that speed and transition, who can't. And these kids, they know as well. Okay? They know right away, hey, you know what? I can't do that. So either I got to play at that speed or I got to do something else. Okay? But it's, it's, it's very quick feedback. All right? Now we go three on three transition, and I got one more fun drill to do, and then we're done. Uh, get three guys up. Third guy, good. Shot goes up now. Okay, the middle guy gets it. Okay, he must catch it somewhere in the paint. You guys, best thing in the world. You don't have to do anything else but take off. Okay, now there's some strategy involved. You guys figure it out. Who's going to get back? Are you going to risk it by crashing? Okay, you guys figure it out. Right now, they're, White's going to go. Ready? Get back. Same thing. Outlet goes here. Good. Keep it one way. Good talk there, uh, Massey. Go run, 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 you two. Good job. Good job. Good box out. Where's the outlet going? Go. Other guys, run low. Pitch it. Ooh, hit it. We're all crashing. Good, good. It goes middle. Pitch it. Good. Good idea though. Pitch it here. You guys are off, Black. Go, 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 White. Go, 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 keep it. Go. So turnover would be minus one for us. Good. Where's it going? Where's it going? Good. Other two guys run. Hey, run and run, right? Just take off, low. When, they, when, they, when you know you got a rebound, just take off. Because the outlet's going here, right? You're a wing runner now. Just go. You can't be this tired, are you? 30 minutes, man. Where's it go? Where's it go? Good, good, good. Go run low. Go run, run, pitch it, pitch it. Good, good, go play. No, keep it one way. Good, good. Use your length. Use your length. Good. Now pick a spot. Pick a spot. There you go. Good job. Now just solid. Good job. I'll let it. Good job. Good job, big fella. Real good job. Right. Keep your length, right? You're long as hell. Right? You don't want to be right here, right? You want to just be here so you're too disruptive, right? They're not comfortable around you. Right? Being here, it's almost like you're working way too hard. Being here, it's shit. You can do everything. Three, two, one, chuck it up. Eh, not bad. Okay. Uh, da, 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 da. Last one. Let's all come down here. Actually, no. Let's keep those two lines there. Like, give me one kid up. You can come up. Okay, we call it Vegas. We've all seen it. Here. Rebound low, rebound. Come on up. So we'll go two on one, three on two, four on three, five on four, five on five. Come up. You're going to rebound. Low, you're gas, man. We need a sub. Big fella, come on up. Sorry, man. Good job today. Proud of you, man. Good job, Low. You gave me 35 minutes of demo basketball. Okay, hop off. Rebounder, rebounder. It's a free throw. Can you make a free throw? There's no net. If you airball, it's going to be like off the wall. You know that, right? All right. Now, today we're going to play the red line, son. All right. Please give me a great routine. Give me some funky routine. Don't give me three dribbles and a spin. You know these ones? Okay, so he'll shoot it. If it goes in, great. You're going to go two on one. You're going to be on defense. Okay, they shoot it, whatever. Foreman. Ah, did. DeAndre? Elijah, who is it? Okay, then you come down three on two. You guys will be on defense. Next two will come in, four on three. You got it? Give me something. No, no, regular free throw? 
Get back, man. Go, 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 go. Stunt at it. Stunt at it. Or not. Three, two, one. That's it. One shot. Go. Get back. Get back. Get back. Oh, go play. Three or two. Pitch it or play. Go for it. Go, 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 go. We have two minutes. Oh, uh, boy. Get back. Get back. Get back. Go, go, go. Go. Four, four. Go, go. Stay on. You. Stay on. Go. Good. It's four on three. Good pitch. Good. Go, go, go. Five on four. Good job. Pitch it. Pitch it. It'd be five on five now. Oh, good hustle. Play it. Play it. Get back, come on, low. Good, get back, get back. Good, go, 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 last possession. You're dying to get on, right? Seven on five, maybe. Three, two, win the game. Oh, time. Give these kids a big hand. Thanks, guys. Okay. I, okay. Um, I only got a minute and a half left. Uh, the best DVD that I've seen lately was uh, Stan Van Gundy on Coaching You Live. Uh, he does a great thing. He just sits there and he had a topic. I don't think he likes this topic. So he started and said, hey, do you have any questions? And then they just rambled off random questions. I wanted to do that, but somebody didn't let me. Just joking. Okay, do we have any questions? Please ask me something so I can pretend I know something about basketball. Questions about transition, offense, defense, pick and rolls. Yes, sir. It's, it's, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. Um, just because you won't know where they're going to be when the shot goes up and stuff. It's, it's one of the great things, or it's just always part of my language, but one of the crappy things about that is that you don't know where you're going to be. But you teach your kids how to play. They, they can play all positions, use the screen, space. So there's always, it, with everything, there's going to be some give and take. I've never ran it, so I don't know. It's something that you would have to play, play around with. And like I said before, what do you believe in? Is it that important that you want those two guys to be primary scorers, to be using the screens on certain parts of the floor? So you can make a read that it's going to be true for you and react, but you would say you would flare more often or you curl, so you would keep them on this half. But like I said, what are your, we talked about before, what are your core values? Okay, what do you believe in the most? Uh, and then you have to kind of tinker and, and you got to give some and you got to take away some too. Any other questions? Please give me two more. Yes, ma'am. Yeah. Too far, yeah. Okay, great question. She asked that when do I want my initial contact with the ball, basically. Uh, honestly, it depends who my two get back guys are and knowing their own speed. Okay? And at our level, hopefully we know what the numbers are like. Okay? Uh, if we know that there's two behind me and I got one guy back, I'll be really soft. Meaning, if I know I have one guy behind me and it's, I have the ball and there's that, I'll be soft to buy time. Okay? Our big thing is we want to get hoop, we want to stop the ball, but our big thing we talk about in practice always is buying time, buying time, buy time for your team, buy time. So if we have more than one person back, let's say I have two back ready, shoot, I can be aggressive. But I, if I know I got one back and I got, I got the ball and there's another one there, I can't leave my teammate out to dry. I just want to buy them every extra second, slow it down so we can get back to a four and four, three and three, five and five, somewhere in the even numbers. But yes. Uh, we talk about toughness, okay? We talk about communication. We talk about discipline. Uh, and the last one we have, or our fourth one, we just looked this up, is discipline. Discipline, toughness, discipline, toughness, Compete, discipline, toughness, compete, communication. Those are four. Um, I worked with someone named Ron with Kula. Uh, he helped us out a ton last year, and he was big into those. Those are core values. I know it's a big thing that what's your philosophy, of course. I, I love those things. It just, 
what do they look like? You know, we can say it all. It's just like most of us are educators first, and then we talk about it. What does it look like? I got to do a much better job uh, as a coach of taking the time and communicating with my guys. Okay? I think I, I think they know I love them. I think I got to take the time to communicate with them on a personal level. Okay, two minutes a day. Okay, my practice plan goes like this. Um, as every assistant coach has someone beside them, it'll say JP, it'll say Pookie, it'll say Troy, whoever it is. Yeah, the big thing is Pookie. Um, but during water break, during free throws, they'll go by and say, hey, how's the sociology class going? Hey, did you get moved in? Hey, how are groceries going? Is the place clean? Meeting without meetings is I got to do a much better job of. We know how hectic we are. It's so much easier to send a text now than to bring the kid and just have a casual conversation with. That's what I got to work on uh, is that communication part. I think the basketball part uh, is not bad. One more question? Any more questions? Okay, like I said, uh, gobobcats.ca is our website. Anything I can help you with. I d I'll be honest, I don't, I have, what's that thing called? Fast draw? Fast draw? We use Fast Scout. I have Fast Draw. I don't draw up any of my plays on a computer or anything. If you need something, let me know. I can talk you through it. I can scan something to you. That'll be scribbled on paper. Uh, but whatever you need, we owe the world to uh, all you club and high school coaches. And like I said, I am no better coach than anybody in this room. Okay? I was lucky. I was fortunate. I had some great mentors. Um, and the last thing before I go too far is uh, there's people at your high schools and your club teams that want to help. I have, I guarantee, the best coaching staff in Canada West. They get paid this much. Okay? I got a grad assistant, John Ross. I got Brett Norris, a high school teacher, uh, high school coach, coaches everything. I got a chemist. I got a guy who lays table. I got four dudes that get paid nothing that I will travel the world with that we can sit there, talk about basketball, play cards, talk about the kids like they're our own kids. Okay? Find someone that will help you out, that are good people, that will also give you crap. When I'm not doing my job, they're the first ones, hey, Gil, man, you, you can't communicate that way. Hey, Gil, we got to be more organized in this and this. Okay? I, I think there's people out there that want to help you and find those right people. I got four of the best coaches in the world, okay, and they get paid jack squat. All right, like I said, if you need anything from me, our website, email me. My number's on there. Text, text me. <laughs> Don't call. Um, but whatever you need, we can talk. I would love to be someone's mentor or help you out your season, whatever it is. Okay, thank you.